The most gratifying part, just being in a state when I'm working where I'm not thinking about anything, I'm not bothered by anything, I'm just concentrating on what it is that I'm doing. And the same with weaving basketry is there's absolutely nothing that exists in the world except for you in that basket that you're weaving. Um, a lot of my family members, you know, were saying, well, why would you go to art school? You know, what's the point of being an artist? And they finally understood that I needed to leave the community and I needed to go into an art institution to have that dialogue with people from not only from uh, Aboriginal culture but non-Aboriginal cultures so that in myself, like in my spiritual being, I understood what my journey was about. Art school taught me how to speak and it taught me how to listen and it taught me how to see, which I think is going to help me not only my development as an artist but my development as a person. Everything happens by accident. That's what discovery is all about. So I ended up going back to the concept of identity and symbolism, metaphors, all of that came back to what I had known all of my life, which was Mi'kmaq basketry. You know, you had to leave the reserve and go to school somewhere else to come back to what it is that you know. If I were to sum up in a few words what it is that describes my art. It would be um, that it's all about exploration. I'm exploring how to communicate what it is that I feel like, you know, my spirit or my chijamich wants to communicate to others. Mm -hmm.